Like I'm so tired. I'm doing all these stairs. <sighs> okay. So I just did, I think this was my fourth one. I have to do one more. It's only 9.08 though. So I might try to see if I can get two more sets out. I don't want to overdo it though because I'm taking a heated yoga class at 10. And it's Vinyasa, so I don't want to die. So I might just do one more set actually. Okay, so I just finished the stairs. Sweaty, sweaty Betty. <laughs> so now I'm about to go to the yoga studio, check it out, it's my first time going. Um, and I'll let y'all know how I like it. So I took class at Kinship Yoga in Highland Park. It was so good. I took class with Ace. Um, so great, she's so good. That was such a good class, it felt like it's nice as hate class with someone that like one looks like you but two like kind of teaches the same way you do so like you can finally get the experience that you give everyone else oh it was so good it was a, a heated class so i had to like take pauses at times because i haven't taken a heat class in so long um but it was literally like just like everything I needed. The music was like really similar to what I do. Um, just the vibe. And like, she's such a like, you could like she tell she's a genuine. She's also probably been teaching for a long time. So she's just really good. But oh, uh, it was such a good class. So right now I'm about to go to Target. Do I need anything? No. Oh, I also went to Civil Coffee and I got the Arroyo. So it has like, they were out of oat milk. So they did the cashew almond half and half. And it has like lavender syrup in it espresso it's basically a latte um but i got that i sat outside for a little bit but it was kind of crowded and i need to go back to the house and clean up and i'm thinking that i might get cute today because it's a monday so places might not be too crazy and if my friend is not available for a happy hour i might i don't have a kid tonight so i might um go either take myself to dinner or I might go to a happy hour and then bring my butt home. I'm still trying to be like cost effective and not spend an, an excessive, where is my air thing? An excessive amount of money until I get a job, but also Miss Mamas today. That class started my day off so well. So I think for now, while I'm still staying on the east side, I'm gonna take the, walk the stairs in the morning first and then come to the heated yoga after and then start my day there. But that just made me feel good. Like today's Monday, that just started my day off really well. I'm feeling good. Um, and I'm really excited to see like where the rest of my day goes. I'm still waiting for the car company to call me about my car. They said it was gonna be delivered between the 17th and 19th, today's the 19th. I haven't heard anything. So if I don't hear from them tomorrow, I'm gonna call the company just so I can get an ETA, like, you know? Cause I'm returning the rental car. Where is my thing? I'm returning the, oh, here we go. I'm returning the rental car tomorrow. And luckily I, my cousins are out of town so I can use their car if I need to get around. But, and I guess I can extend the rental, but who wants to spend that money? Not me, so. There's that on that. So come with me to Target. <laughs> okay, so I literally, I had a whole plan day plan today. I was gonna make it like an LA day, but my car was supposed to be delivered between the 17th and the 19th. I was in the shower, I need to finish showering, but I was in the shower and I get a phone call and it was like, girl answer. And I did, and they were just letting me know that my car is currently right now, 10, 18. They were like, your car is gonna get delivered between, um, your car will be delivered between uh 12 p.m and 1 p.m so i was like okay cool here's the thing i'm supposed to return my rental at one o'clock i know i, I should have gotten i was up since like 6 a.m i should have just went back and returned it early but i was sitting here playing games so now i'm stressing out <laughs> because i'm just like now nah, i'm probably gonna have to pay for like a late delivery i guess for the rental car because it's all the way by lax my face is breaking out it's all the way by lax and i'm on in i'm an hour away 
right now I'm like an hour away or a little under an hour away. So there's no way for me to return the rental, get back in time before the guy potentially delivers my car and there's no one at the house right now to receive the car. <laughs> so I just text Enterprise because they did like a chat thing and was signed, seeing if I can extend the rental until four because I figure if he does come between 12 and one, like I think he probably will be on time and come between 12 and one, I can extend it until four. And then by the time I get my car, make sure it's all legit, make sure I got what I need and then you know, go about my business. I had a whole day plan today though. Like I woke up and did some yoga. I was gonna like return the car early, go to um that Hilltop coffee shop, like get some work done. I was gonna go to the movie. It's a $2 Tuesday, not $2 Tuesday, like $5 Tuesday or whatever. I was gonna go see that Woman King movie. I think I'm still gonna see it tonight. But like I had all these plans and I was just like, so yeah. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm currently waiting for the driver to contact me to let me know like what his ETA is. It's 12 o'clock right now, so there's no way that he's gonna make it up this hill, so I'm probably gonna have to walk down the hill, um, which is fine. I wouldn't even want him to attempt that because I don't know how big the truck is that he's driving with the vehicles on it. Um, but yeah, so my cousins live on like a hill, so I have to go down. A little bit so i hope he gives me enough time because it is a bit of a walk um but i'm so excited to be getting my car and then i have to hustle um i did call enterprise and they told me that they do a two hour grace period i'm not sure if i said that already but before i had called i had did the texting and asked for it to be extended until four and they said that was fine okay so i literally literally just hung up with y'all to tell y'all that like i'm waiting for the driver and he literally just messaged me <laughs> he literally just said i'll be there in 20 minutes i'll call you when like where i stop at so eager me kind of just wants to walk down the hill now because <laughs> it's gonna take me probably like 20 minutes to get down there but i'm just so excited <laughs> so this is we're at the top of the hill but i honestly i think the hill continues but this is just part of a hill i'm so excited to be getting my car <laughs> but now I have to go down another windy hill. <sighs> All right, so there's the highway. I don't know if y'all can see it, but that's the highway up there. So I'm assuming he's getting off of the freeway and then he'll be on the main road. So I have to show you like, it's so windy over here that he was never gonna make it up the hill <laughs> with these hills. Y'all probably can't see, but I see. I'm so excited. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> my poor baby is so dirty. Hi, on my dent. Yes. Baby can't cross country. Y'all, I'm in my car. Here, we are in the flesh. Make sure my gas is still in here. Uh, okay. <laughs> he was cute. He was sweet. Not, I mean, not cute, but he was sweet. I need to wipe up and down here because I know I had this man touching on my shit. Say less. Oh my God, I'm in my car. Okay, now I gotta hurry up and go to rest company. See you. <laughs> Okay, so I just had an interview in West Hollywood. Oof. And so I was so close to the Grove. I was like, let's go to the Grove. I have my computer. I need to edit um, a vlog anyway. So I was like, I can get lunch somewhere and use the bathroom too because I have to pee really bad. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna find someplace cute over here to like have lunch and you know the vibes.
This is grungy that I have in my head. <laughs> So you heard it first. Karen has decided that he's gonna make all my YouTube videos with me. He's going for it. He's gonna his career. I don't know if she's talking about it. <laughs> Who is this woman? Help! Help! Imagine having me and fumbling me.